Hey guys, welcome back to Starfire Blocks. Today we'll be taking a look at the latest top horror games in Roblox you need to be playing right now. Let's get straight into it. Number 6. The Mirror Too much time spent staring at oneself in the mirror might have negative consequences. Your mind, not the mirror, is the only one who plays the games on you. Be wary of the spooky noises and play in the dark to get the full effect of the game. Number 5. Identity Fraud You should absolutely give Identity Fraud a shot. It's a horror-themed puzzle or maze game that some refer to as a scented con game. The goal of the game is to get through all the three mazes without being killed by the monsters. At the conclusion of each labyrinth, there are gates that must be opened by pressing the green button. The first map is simply a corridor of lanterns and it is, in my opinion, the scariest. A gloomy hedge maze is the second map. The third location is a type of abandoned office or hospital. You'll come across a variety of monsters, including Stan, is a fully black and can be found in all three labyrinths. With glowing red eyes, he will appear behind you and pursue you while your back is turned. He is more frightening than bothersome, and as long as you keep your gaze fixed on him, he won't be able to kill you. You have to spin around for a little to get away from him and wait for him to scream, but it sounds like there is a tremendous wind. You must start sprinting straight now and not look back. He will vanish and stop following you after 10 seconds of running. He has the appearance of an all-black knight. He is particularly frightening. He will simply pursue you with his sword. Ralph was only found in the first labyrinth, which was unusually enough. To get away from him, you must lead him to another player in the game, where he will instead pursue them. Fraud, not prevalent, but found in all three labyrinths. He is the most terrifying to many people since he will impersonate another player in the game and is nearly difficult to escape. You might believe he's just another random gamer, but when he waves, you'll know he's a con artist. Your screen will zoom and you will accelerate in lockstep with him. You just have to keep going until he decides to stop following you. There just isn't any way out for him. Number 4. Dead Silence Dead Silence is one of Roblox's most popular horror games and a fan favorite. If you think you're up to it, play with or alone with up to three friends. Dead Silence is the title of a supernatural horror film released in 2007. Jamie Ashen and Lisa get an anonymous ventriloquist doll as a gift. Billy walks out to get some supper while Lisa stays at home and plays with the doll. When Billy returns, he discovers Lisa is dead, her tongue hacked out. A statement about Mary Shaw, a deceased ventriloquist from Raven's Fair, can be found inside the ventriloquist's box. In Dead Silence, unravel the mystery of Mary Shaw. Number 3. The Apartment The Apartment is a horror game in which players explore a vast apartment building. You make your way up through the numerous floors, either alone or with a friend. There are strange sounds, weird figures, and jump scares on every level. The higher you go, the creepier things become. Number 2. Alone in a Dark House The title of this game says it all. You've found yourself alone in a dark house, and if you're up to it, you'll need to investigate. You'll come across a number of strange artifacts as you put together the atrocities that have occurred in the house. We recommend that you play alone in a dark house by yourself for the greatest experience. Number 1. School History School History is a horror game in which you must solve the mysteries of a school. It's a fun, scary Roblox game to play with your pals. Work your way through the school, hunting for keys and other tools as you go. You never know what you'll find behind closed doors, so keep an eye out for scary jumps. This brings me to the end of our video. That's all for me today. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you guys could hit the like on this video and turn on notification. So when I upload next, you guys get notified would mean a lot. Also, if you guys could hit the big red button and subscribe to my channel, it would be great. That's all for me today. See you guys in the next video and peace.